basic footwork for the skill set of an advanced level peekaboo offensive attack. But before I get started, I'd like to introduce myself for those of you who have never watched this channel. Shame on you. And boy, you're late to the dance. My name is Eric A. Bradley, a.k.a. Coach, that is. And now you're tuning in to the fight show. And what we're going to do is go over some very important fundamentals when it comes down to executing your offensive prowess, utilizing a serious basis of immense level footwork. Let's take it front and center with Coach Bradley inside. And I'm going to show you how this all transitions. Why is it so important to execute and understand how this all looks whenever you are front and center inside of the process of developing these skill sets? You think about the old greats like the Tony Zales, the Mike Tysons, the Floyd Pattersons, all of these Jose Torreses, these guys who are known for that peekaboo like style. These are some serious breakdowns and we're looking forward to sharing them with you right here. So what we're going to do right now is I'm going to put the demonstration of all of these teachings directly in front of you. So make sure you enjoy. And I'm about to shrink down into the smaller half and you can enjoy the tape. How do you use basic footwork? with advanced level offense. Let's say you're using the peekaboo and you wanted to make sure your base was sturdy. What you want to do is go through these steps. First and foremost, you want to get the footwork down. So we use what you call an accent box step. And everything you do has a base with it. Now you have that first part. The next part you wanna execute is your defense. So you're gonna block. And this is a bracket. Boom. Block with a bracket. Bracket meets the punch. That's when you're going into the next tier. The next thing you wanna do is make sure that your body's positioned. So here and here. That's your drop slip. Here, here, three-point axis drop, ankle, knee, hip. It has to be that way to go into your positioning. Your positioning at that point is creating an angle. And once you create the angle, pop, you're over here. Now you're gonna come up with a Mexican. That Mexican up jab, boom, right hook and that Tony Zell heart punch right below the heart, executing what we call that throw shot. You hit that shot, boom, that shovel punch will throw them off, boom, right to the heart, and you're out of there. Congratulations. And there you have it. That technique breakdown showed you how to utilize the basic accent box step to execute the next phases, which will be the slips, which are one of the things that are gonna get you out of the way of harm. And then you're gonna make sure that you got your defensive bracket up. That bracket block, that's where you catch the punch. And then you have to create that slip with the three axis point dip, all right? So that will allow you to come up and go into your offense. That's how you get out of the way, be elusive, be invisible. And then from that point, you can execute that Mexican boom, up jab, that serious punch that catches them where they cannot see, positions you to hit them in a manner in which they can't really figure out where those shots are coming from. And that is that shovel punch. It's a hook thrown by the right hand this time, like a southpaw would do it. The shovel hook comes from out of nowhere, boom. And from that point, it's right there in your face. 
knocking you out unconscious. And if that doesn't, that undershot, that upward hook, uppercut to the sternum, right up under the heart, we call that the Tony Zell. That's where guys like Mike Tyson learned his fight style. He developed it. That's where he learned. The Zell family sent me this book, The Man of Steel. It's a great read. Trust me. Thanks, Haley. Thanks, Ted. The authors and family of the great late Tony Zell had a most impactful style of offense that was built on grit, base foundation. And that's what we're teaching you here in the School of Boxing on the Fight Show. As you guys have followed and listened and learned, we are doing what we are doing to educate you guys. So for those of you who've never watched this channel, be sure to subscribe if you like to learn boxing firsthand and continue to follow us, Master Boxing across the board. The logo says it all. This is the school of boxing. And down here, it's the weekend and we have uh, opportunity for everybody to jump on board and take advantage of getting those peekaboo lessons uh, front and center. It's uber important that you guys take full advantage of these opportunities and learn boxing the right way. Until next time, be blessed at God's speed. Subscribe. Be sure you tell a friend because it's going down. See you next week. Have a great holiday weekend.